So, what meditation are we going to do? We're going to do a simple breathing meditation again. The meditation functions, it's like a preliminary practice. Breathing meditation helps us to calm our mind, to, to get some clarity, to, to let go of the say the waves of distraction in our mind. Our mind can see as, it's like an ocean of consciousness on which many waves of thoughts and feelings and memories are arising continuously. And sometimes it's pretty stormy, other times it's just a bit choppy, other times it's, it's relatively calm. But what we're going to try to do is bring it to complete calm, to a point of stillness. Not easy, but we're trying. We do our best. If we can do that, then we'll experience a sense of incredible peace and happiness, real deep happiness that comes when there are no waves of uncontrolled thoughts and distractions. So that's our objective, to connect into our deep source of inner happiness, real happiness, you could say true happiness that comes from a, a very calm and peaceful mind, which is free from the disturbing, distracting, Thoughts, delusions, our anger, our anxieties, our worries and problems. So the way we meditate is we just use the feeling of the breath in the tip of the nostrils. And it's going back to the analogy of the ocean. We can think if we're sort of lost at sea in a very stormy uh, time when we haven't got a motor on our boat or whatever and we, it was broken. And that's how, <laughs> unfortunately, we often live our life. We're sort of just constantly overpowered by the waves of our own thoughts and, and emotions, just like a boat adrift with, without a motor. So the only thing that people in such a dangerous situation can do is throw over the anchor and hope that it catches and holds firm. And if it does, then the boat's safe. The waves come and the waves go, but the boat just stays still. It's not going to be washed onto the rocks and and so just has to wait until the waves finally die down as the wind stops blowing the waves will calm down the ocean will become still then we can carry on our journey so the same with our breath we use our breath as like the anchor to hold our mind and hold ourself, we can say, hold ourselves still in the ocean of our mind. So we're letting the waves of our worries, our problems, our thoughts and distractions just come and go. We're paying no attention to them. We're paying all our attention to the feeling of the breath. That's our anchor. We have to hold it, the, the rope that is tied to the anchor and is mindfulness. It's our memory. We're not forgetting moment by moment. We're not losing our focus, our concentration on the feeling of the breath in the tips of the nostrils. And so as long as we're holding on to that rope of mindfulness, we're keeping our focus principally on the feeling of the breath, then we will. We, we, 
we'll be able to let go of the waves of thoughts and feelings and coming. We might have a feeling arising like a wave of pain in our head. Suddenly we feel, oh, my head's exploding. <laughs> and But if we can just keep our mind focused on the breath with the determination to let go of any wave of thought or feeling or distraction, we can, if we keep hold of the anchor of the breath, we can feel that pain and gradually just at least reducing and stopping pulling our mind, stopping distracting, stopping our mind from getting stuck in it and hurting. <laughs>